guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you quickly how you can um, use the outliner. Let's create a whole bunch of different objects. A sphere, a cube, a cylinder, a cone, a torus, and a plane. Okay, so these guys are all over the top of each other, and we could go through here and select them and move them apart. But wouldn't it be good if we could see what was in our scene? Move over to the left side of your screen here, and click on your outliner. That's the bottom button here. Click on that and your outliner pops up. Your outliner lists the different objects that are in your scene and lets you select them by clicking on them. So we can click our sphere, click, press our W key, move our sphere into a new place. We can click on our cube, move it into a new place. Our cylinder can be moved to a place over here, cone over here, torus over there, plane, let's make this one bigger. Easy, right? The other nice thing about the outliner is we can come in here and we can double click on these to give them a name. Often when you're working with your um, own objects, you're going to want to give them names because they're going to do particular things. You can give them any name you want over here. Um, Maya doesn't like you to use um, spaces or any kind of punctuation. So if I called this guy um, um, Cone of Fear, then when I press return, you'll see it'll put in little underscores for me instead of the spaces. Okay, so you can give things names if you want to. And that's the outliner. It's pretty simple to use.